All right, so let's play this in full here. Let's see. <laughs> Wasn't that just magnificent? I was worried it was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that finale, <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, so let's see. You said you kept the transition, but add more change in the first bit and change the last pose. Yes, for sure. Flesh it all out. All right. Opinions before uh, splining. Wasn't that, wasn't that just magnificent? There's still an element of repetition there. I do like that you go lower. But then once we get this spot here, this whole section is all the same. Wasn't that just magnificent? I mean, one thing that you could try, if you want to make this a bit more interesting, is have them... What if... I know this is, again, th throwing changes out there, but obviously feel free to ignore everything. What if, at the beginning, he is a bit more turned over and actually looks at, at this playground and goes... Wasn't that just like... Looks to us, and then... Magnificent? I don't know, I don't know if you have time to look. I was thinking about looking over this way, looking over the other way, but well, there's nothing here. But it could be a thing of, <clears throat> it might be turned over, looking here, turning a bit so that he's three quarter at us, looking at us, and then going back to looking maybe over here, and then coming towards the end to this. If that makes sense. Wasn't that just magnificent? I was worried it was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that finale, <laughs> wow. Then I don't know. I mean, he's not exactly talking about the structure, is he? Wasn't that just magnificent? I was worried he was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that finale. <laughs> mm, yeah, no, I'm talking about something he performed. So I don't know. There's something I feel like if there's anything that we can do where, where, um, see this clap all the time, huh? Wasn't that just magnificent? Yeah, there need to be something, just something a bit more where, he might, he might start off with a pose that's potentially... I know I'm changing things again, but where he might be hunched over and then... <laughs> and then gets up and then... Wasn't that just magnificent? Wasn't that just magnificent where he has almost like a bit of a wavy action in the head going left and right? Oh, wasn't that? He's a bit more celebration-y in its, in its acting. It's not just in here. <laughs> that's all. That's the only thing where... <laughs> Wasn't that just magnificent? Even that is okay, but then it just gets, it really stalls into always the same thing. And it might get better once you do a, you know, more facial stuff, but I feel like there's something that we can push a bit more because in a way it's, it's this whole section comes down and, and it's just, it's kind of the same, but hunched over. And I know that's something that I was suggesting, but seeing it now, it feels like it's just not enough, but I don't want to dictate, you know, I do this, do that. So if you have any ideas as well. I'm obviously open, but to me, it seems like you want to do something where it can be a bit more. Wasn't that just magnificent? You know, where he might start like this, like I said, and maybe then he straightens up and then goes. Wasn't that just magnificent? And then as he does that, maybe he, he leans his head back and closes his eyes. He's like in a dream state or something. Magnificent? And then right at the end, you know, gets back into this to go into that potentially. That's that's a potential thought there. I was I was worried it was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that. Fin Switch out. It feels a bit broken in how far back this goes. If there's anything we can do to show the elbow a bit more, so it doesn't feel like that is a little short arm that grows out of the side, just for silhouette. But then that finale. You know, even if it's I don't know if you want to go. And change the hand and actually grasping the other way. I don't, I don't know if that would be very comfortable. <laughs> wow. This wow. is definitely better. Um, slightly concerned about the fast camera movement. I know this is just in step. So but once we see a spline camera, it might just work with the whole energy. Wow. But I do like this. And I do like the offset. I do like the uh, last pose. I think this works a lot better. Um, so my main concern is mainly... The beginning just feels very, very simple. And I think you can, because you have great poses otherwise, I think you can absolutely pull this off and bring something a bit more interesting into in, into this section, acting-wise. Wasn't that just magnificent? It's a bummer that the clapping is so repetitive. Wasn't that just magnificent? Yeah, it could be something where potentially he starts also with lower shoulders. 
and then he does this whole uh, and then imagine you know going back like i said maybe the head up eyes closed and then the shoulders are up and he's really in this into this trance state of ah oh, this was so great that's magnificent and then gets into that something like that um so yeah i wonder if you're already cutting things off if you want to bring that leg down here then we just cut off that thing and that way we have a cleaner uh just a cleaner silhouette there on that leg so it's not going into this it's not a huge thing because we do have a color change but i don't know this could be a bit more comfortable it's also pretty bent we're almost waiting for a foot roll so this might just help with making this a bit more relaxed and because of that giving us a nicer silhouette and negative space there same thing with this arm kind of grows out of there i don't know if there's a way to potentially see just the bends of that arm there i was worried he was getting a little dodgy in the middle part but then that finale <laughs> what? and then don't forget here and that finale <laughs> he has the little that finale that huh let me just scrub here finale <laughs> that part that could have a little bit of an up and a bit of a, a jump, a little shoulder thing. <laughs> like a little moment there. So that, you know, you can look out for that once you get into more refined work in terms of splining, right? Because that's your next pass, spline and facial stuff. But anyway, that's it. Again, I don't want to... I hate to, again, change things and throw things out there. It just, I just want to give you my honest opinion that I felt like, oh man, that's kind of a bummer. Even though what I said, I felt like, I guess I was wrong. And it just, it's just, it's still too simple. I thought that's going to be enough of a contrast, but just the the you know the repetitive nature of the clapping, shoulders up, and always the same face doesn't help. So, but I don't think having facial stuff would be just enough. You might have to have a little bit of either you go down with a wavy thing where he does a little bit of acting with the head, or something potentially where, like I said, goes back, um, or something else that you can think of. Um, again, it's your shot, so I don't want to dictate things and you know make it my shot in a way. So. Anything that you want to add, let me know. You can email me, as always. We can have a little discussion about that. And that is it from me now. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.